Hi, I'm Lisa Bone, and I'd like to welcome you to my art studio. This is a wedging board on a 45 degree slant that makes it easy for me to wedge large volumes of clay without stressing out my wrists. It's made out of a plaster. We put reinforcement with chicken wire, and I poured it into a box, and the plaster hardened up, and then we made a angled board for it to sit on, and now I have a slanted wedging board. Now that I showed you my wedging board, I'd like to show you some more tools where we put plaster into cooking sheets, and I teach a lot of young kids' classes, and I can put them on the table in front of each of the kids, and they have their own wedging board and a station to make clay so that it makes it easier for them. Then you can collect your boards and store them. I'd like to show you how I organize my glazes. I have them labeled on the exterior so I don't have to guess which drawer the glazes are in. And I have them organized in my pull-out drawers and labeled on top. So when you look down, you can tell the color of your glazes. One of my favorite tools is the Giffen Grip. And how, what I found is that I color coordinate the lengths of the arms with different colors so that they're easy to visually grab when you need them. So I just can grab the same, the same length in one color, put it in my Giffen Grip, and we're good to go. I'd like to show you how I made my slip basin. I got a big Rubbermaid container, filled it with plaster Paris, and submerged a bowl. When it sets up, you can lift the bowl out and it pops right out of the Rubbermaid container, and you have your slip basin. After you've thrown your pottery and you have all your extra slip, and put it on the, in the plaster bowl. You can collect it up and wedge it back into a nice, usable piece of clay. A lot of my pottery I like to enhance with uh, stones and different embellishments. And a product that I found at Home Depot that I highly endorse was Fast Steel. And you cut it off and you work together Blend it in really good. Put it to your pottery. Add your embellishments. And I'm going to put some fun other pieces of stone in here. And you can further enhance it with tools. And that gives you a nice handle without throwing anything. Thank you for taking a tour of my studio. I hope that my hints have helped you. Happy pottery!